Hello, how are you? Welcome to another question and session. Question and answer session. And here is the question. First of all, read the question very carefully. Then pick up the key points to answer the question. A 23 years old man is involved in a fight. During the dispute, he sustains a laceration to the posterior aspect of his arm. Approximately 2 cm proximal to the polycranial process. On assessment in the emergency department, he is unable to extend his elbow joint, which of the following tendon is most likely to have been cut. So, after careful reading, now pick up the most important point. 23 years old man involved in the fight during a dispute. Uh, he has sustained laceration in the posterior aspect of the right arm and it is 2 cm proximal to the olecranon process. And on emergency department of assessment, unable to extend elbow joint. So, this point is very, very important. And second one here, most likely have cut and this is the tendon that means tendon lies in the terminal part of the muscle so we have to find out one of the muscle which causes extension of the elbow joint so here are the options options are triceps muscle pronator teres muscle brachioradialis muscle brachialis muscle and biceps muscle so we have to find out one of the options or one of the muscle tendon which is uh, which extends the elbow joint and which lies at the extensor aspect of the elbow joint and in the olecranon area. So in the first picture here we can see the extension that means this and here we can see the flexion and when the hand goes like this direction it will be extension. So here we can see this is the extension. So the muscle group which lies in the extensor aspect of the arm it will causes extension so here we can see this is the posterior aspect or extensor aspect of the arm and here we can see one of the muscle and this muscle here we can see it has the three heads one is the long head and lateral head and medial head so it has three head that means three shapes and from this the name of the muscle is triceps so see this is here we can see this is the triceps muscle and here we can see the tendon of the triceps muscle and here we can see this is the olecranon process and the injury occurred at the olecranon process about 2 cm proximal to the olecranon process that means this tendon and this tendon is the triceps muscle tendon so our final answer is, is the tendon of the triceps because the tendon of the triceps it lies proximal to the olecranon process just proximal to the olecranon process and this olecranon process uh, attachment of the triceps muscle and triceps muscle causes extension of the elbow joint and it is one of the large muscle and it is the chief muscle of extension of the elbow joint so the triceps muscle tendon is cut during this procedure thank you all